So now let's look at how an Exium 20R tells us whether a module's in COM loss or not. So on the home screen, we have a number of icons. You want to find the icon with the name network on it. So depending on how many icons we have, you may have to use the right arrows here, that page up and page down. In this case, I'm going to page down. And there you can see my network icon. I'm going to push my network icon. And this will show you all the networks this Exium 20R has on it. So this one has three networks, a Spectrum 3, a Spectrum 4, and a BACnet network. On the far right hand side, it tells you how many modules are on that corresponding network. So in this case, Spectrum 3 has three net modules. Spectrum 4 also has three modules, but my BACnet network has four modules. So depending on what modules you're looking for to see what's in COM loss or not, you'll have to press that corresponding network. So in this example, we'll just hit Spectrum 3. So here are my three modules that I have, a CIM41, a MinIO01, and a CMS050. And here you can see all three of those are down. So in this case, I'm going to go check the modules for their power and communication voltages, maybe check their addressing to make sure that's correct, come back to the Exium 20 r check the communication voltages on the terminals there with no wires attached, and try and verify and figure out what's wrong with those modules and why they're in COM loss.